Chuck Fresh taking a look at Amazon's new Halo band. Kind of measures your fitness and your heartbeat and all that stuff. I probably don't. Last person in the world doesn't have a smartwatch because I don't pay three hundred bucks when I have a phone that really does everything except measure some of your vital statistics. So I really needed something. I figured this price was right. So let me pick up one of these. It just came out. Look pretty cool. It's kind of svelte, right? A little thicker than I expected, but not bad. I mean, it looks pretty good on the wrist. It's kind of, you know, like a little wristband. Sometimes people wear wristbands. I used to, but well, maybe I'll start again. Who knows? comes with a little USB charger. It doesn't come with the AC adapter, but you can plug it into just about anything. I mean, even lamps have USB chargers in them now, so I have one by my nightstand. This is the little charging unit, little spring-loaded deal, and you got to match up those little pins there. And then I'm just going to use one of my old Samsung USB adapters and uh, charge this baby up. So. Uh, so yeah, you just pop it in there and the thing charges. It says every uh, three to four days, but uh, we'll see how it goes. I guess the more you use it and the more you monitor it, the more battery it's going to do. So you wait for the white light to kind of blink. Mine didn't come on. I had to do a whole reset. Download the app. There's a whole bunch of Halo apps out there. So make sure you click on the one that says Amazon Halo. And uh, then it loads up and you can set up your band. It connects via Bluetooth. You got to put your birthday in there, your height, and then it asks for your weight. Just some benchmark statistics connected to your uh, Bluetooth, and then it does the rest. It does some updates and uh, sets the whole thing up and starts communicating with your phone, which is really what I paid the big bucks for anyway. So they give you a six-month free membership, and I'm not sure they're going to charge for it afterwards, but uh, we'll see what happens there, see if we're addicted to it. So fixed it up, put it on my wrist, and uh, here's the app, and it tells you all this stuff here. What's really interesting is this thing listens to your voice. It has a little microphone in it, and this just blows my mind that they can do this. So you set it up, you go through a whole bunch of stuff here, and it listens to you speak during the day. I know that's a little disturbing. A lot of people are like, well, this thing's listening. Is it recording me? It's kind of weird, right? It's right, so the first thing I wanted. This is the most important thing. Samsung no longer offers the heart monitor on the phone. I really missed that. So that's there now. So, so I said, oh, let's mess with this microphone thing. Maybe we'll learn something here. So you go through the whole setup and you read a whole bunch of stuff and it sets a benchmark for your voice. And once it does, you have to read like six things. You go through it, analyzes your voice, creates the benchmark. And now supposedly it can listen hey, to you. Hey, how you doing? In it's live great mode. to be here today. Woohoo! This is great. Oh my God, I have so much energy. This is so great. I can't believe how fast I'm speaking right now. This should really be high energy more than positive. Woohoo! Now I'm a professional actor. Oh so. man, I'm really tired. <sighs> Not that, that I matters. I wonder if but... this thing can recognize a yawn. Oh man, I hate this place. This place drives me crazy. I can't stand this It's job. pretty on point, right? But I'm so happy to be here and get that large paycheck. Woohoo! <laughs> and at the end, it gives you this little report of how you sounded. And it can even listen for you when you're sick. Now, you can mute the microphone. There's some instructions there. If you press the button, it'll mute the microphone. The other thing it does is uh, it tracks your body fat. And it goes through this whole crazy thing, puts your ethnicity in there, and it takes a whole bunch of pictures of your body. It's kind of awkward to set it up because you have to get the whole camera, the front-facing selfie camera, where you can see your whole body. And... It's harder than it thinks because you don't really take pictures. You got to prop it up on something and then it gives you your body mass. It looks like I got to drop a few pounds, but hey, I don't know. I'm going to play with this thing and I'll update my review in a couple of months. We'll see how it goes and determine if we're going to sign up for the subscription. But I think it solves a lot of problems.